retain your language, retain your nationality. That's one statement. One thing is dependent upon the other. That's why there's no thereby in the middle. Retain your language, thereby retain your nationality. Or retain your nationality, thereby retain your language. I suppose you could be done like that. I like that one is more difficult. So if you took the Hebrew Bible, because it's all just squished together letters, and read it in the American way of forward, but the whole, so the whole Bible would be backward, okay, in the Hebrew language. Um, could a computer program like divide up those words? So they actually made words and sentences? Or would it just become a crossword? I probably should have never watched the movie Pi. <laughs> P-I, Pi. So then I was thinking, because this has been my desire for a long time, to find a uh, New Testament that, you know, it's in Greek. <laughs> And have that translated back to Hebrew, more than likely using the Aramaic as your mediator. And because you can't use Greek as a mediator because you're coming out of the Greek to get back into the Hebrew. And then take that Hebrew translation and translate it into English. I try to do that sometimes, and I've been thinking about this since I started in Philippians. I think it's Philippians, Galatians, Ephesians. I think that's the order for the next three books. Or it's the Philippians, Ephesians, Galatians. This is one of these. It's PGE, PEG. Toy boat, toy boat, toy boat. Try that three times fast, too. <laughs> Did you get two? Try it again. So I have tried to do this in the past with uh, old verses, maybe even chapters. I don't remember. Oh, I did uh, First Peter. No, no, no. That's just from the Greek. So anyway, somewhere, somehow, I know I've tried it. It's not easy <laughs> because I had to go back and learn. Uh, pictographic Hebrew, which is just not fun. <laughs> I'd love to spray paint that. Oh, and the camera turns on. Shake, shake. I hope one portion of that was stimulating. Cherishes the new love. Be well.